10 Advice from Winston Churchill for Young People Who Want to Be Rich and Successful Sir Winston Leonard Spencer Churchill was a British politician, army officer and writer who was Prime Minister of the United Kingdom from 1940 to 1945 and again from 1951 to 1955. As Prime Minister, Churchill led Britain to victory in the Second World War. As one of the heroes of the 20th century, Churchill gave some very good advice which will be useful for you if you want to become rich and successful. And that's what this video is all about. Number 8 is very important, so try and watch this video till the end. If you're new here, consider subscribing so you won't miss other interesting videos like this. Number 1. Success consists of going from failure to failure without loss of enthusiasm. While starting out in the business world, I had a plan to spend my first decade achieving nothing. This may sound crazy, but the truth is, if you are not willing to fail again and again, you can't succeed at anything significant. The best way to see success is to compare it with heaven. Most people want to get to heaven, but nobody wants to die. We all want success, but oftentimes, success requires that you pull yourself out, take risks, try things, make mistakes and fail. All these are painful, to say the least, but there is no other way to heaven except through death. As a young person, you are fortunate because you have a lot of time, zeal and passion. These are precious assets you have to get what you want out of life. Don't take life easy. Don't wait for a perfect time. Don't expect anyone to handpick you. Life is all about fighting, going from failure to failure without losing your enthusiasm. Number 2. You never can tell whether bad luck may not, after all, turn out to be good luck. I know a man who spent three years in prison. However, few years after that experience, he said, Thank God I was sent to prison. Somehow, his years in prison had led him into being a better person and his imprisonment has opened a better opportunity for him. Life could sometimes be funny. You never can tell whether what you are going through now is for your good until in the future. That's why you must keep on believing in yourself. Don't pity yourself or blame anyone for your situation. Be courageous and fight forward. Number 3. A pessimist sees the difficulty in every opportunity. An optimist sees the opportunity in every difficulty. There's a common story about two salesmen who went to India to sell shoes. One of them saw a crowd of people without shoes and said, these people can never buy a shoe. While the second guy saw the same scene and said, wow, what if I sell a pair of shoe to every one of these millions of people? I see this all the time. I've seen people complaining about several situations while others are using the same situations to become better, wealthier and more successful individuals. If you change the way you think, what you are seeing will change. Anthony Robbins said, nothing in life has a meaning except the meaning we give them. You can be born into poverty and see that as an opportunity to be a self-made millionaire and you can be born into the richest countries in the world and complain about taxation. Be an optimist and everywhere you go will look greenish. Number 4. Your continuous effort, not strength or intelligence, is the key to unlocking your potential. When you watch great athletes play, what do you think? When you see great scientists, what do you think about them? When you see successful entrepreneurs, what do you think about them? Many people think it takes great talents and luck to be successful, 
But that's not true. If talent makes people succeed, then the world will be filled with success because talent is as common as table salt. The courage, persistence, continuous effort and determination is what you need to be successful in life. Number 5. I like things to happen and if they don't happen, I like to make them happen. I've met many people in my lifetime and it's amazing how almost everyone wants things to happen. Poor people want someone to help them to be rich, either government, their friends, parents or the economy. Lonely people want people to hang around them. Single people want to marry perfect individuals. The level of irresponsibility in our society is unspeakable. Now listen, if you want to go far in life, you must know how to make things happen. Abraham Lincoln said, Things may come to those who wait, but what remains after people who hustle have taken? Usually, it doesn't remain. <laughs> what is your problem right now? What do you think should help you solve it? If that's not you, who else do you think cares about you? Probably no one. Number 6. Success is not final. Failure is not fatal. It is the courage to continue that counts. Brian Tracy said, Success is a journey. And I agree. Your yesterday really doesn't matter. Whether you failed yesterday or you were the best yesterday doesn't matter. What matters is your courage to continue pursuing what really matters to you. Number 7. You will never get to the end of the journey if you stop to shy a stone at every dog that backs. The biggest criticism I've ever received in my life came at the time I followed the biggest dream of my life. Somehow, some people think they have the right to tell you what to do or to transfer their own negativism into you. How much attention do you give to your distractors? How much worries do you have about your critics? If you want to become successful in life, you must learn how to prove people wrong by your success, not your words. If you stop to shy a stone at every dog that backs, you won't get to your destination. Number 8. If you're going through hell, keep going. Winston Churchill had one of the toughest time any human being could imagine. Living his youthful age daring great things and coming to power as UK Prime Minister at the toughest time in the world history. That was hell and the simple formula to go through hell is keep going. Don't look back, blame someone else or give up. You see, problems are like drugs, they have expiring dates. If you can endure long enough, it will expire and there will be a new dawn. If you're going through hell right now, simply keep on going. Number 9. You have enemies. Good. That means you've stood up for something sometime in your life. Most people of the world are conformist and that's why their life is easy. But easy life isn't necessarily a good life. Easy life is a mediocre life. Easy life is average life. Easy life means no one hates you. Easy life means you don't have opinion nor angered people. Easy life means you stand for nothing. That's not a life. When the whole world seems to be at the other side of where you are, you can be sure you are on the right path. Number 10. Never, never, never give up. This should be repeated to you a million times because it's the most important thing you need to understand about life. No matter what life throws at you, look for what to make out of it. No matter how hard you fall, look for what to pick up. No matter how hopeless you think your situation is, look around and create hope. In summary, if you want to be successful in life, be willing to go through several failures without giving up. Believe your perceived bad luck may turn around to be good luck. Be an optimist. See opportunity in every problem. 
be willing to persist during tough times. Don't rely on your yesterday's success or failure. Today is another day. Don't pay much attention to your critics. Win them with your success. Don't wait for things to happen. Go out and make them happen. If you're going through hell right now, keep going. No matter what, never, never, never give up. You enjoyed this video, didn't you? We would like to give you another interesting video for you to enjoy next. But before then, our team will be very happy if you can like this video and share it with your friends on social media. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe so you won't miss other interesting videos like this. Look at your screen now to see two other videos we unpicked for you to enjoy next. We love you.